On Tuesday, for many suburban voters, it's a chance to choose a new state senator. Republican D. Raja and Democrat Pam Iovino are running to replace former Senator Guy Reschenthaler in the state's 37th district. Political editor John Delano has a look at the campaign's final stretch. With the clock ticking until the special election on Tuesday, April 2nd, campaign volunteers at both the Raja and Iovino headquarters were gearing up for the last weekend push. Feeling great, feeling great. We think the momentum is very solidly our way. We feel good. We have a really robust field organization, an army that we're about to uh, send out in the field. That field includes a huge part of Allegheny County, from the Quaker Valley to the western suburbs to the South Hills into Peters Township. For both campaigns, it's about reminding voters that this Tuesday is Election Day. That's entirely what this weekend is about, is GOTV, get out the vote. It's a special election and it all boils down to that. The key is turnout. That, I mean, that's, that's like it's a special election. Whoever gets the turnout is going to win. But that said, it's also the message, and uh, this district is about jobs. Raja, the Republican nominee in a district that usually, but not always, votes Republican, thinks his message is getting through to voters. But both candidates take issue with the negative attacks by the other. Iovino, the Democrat, says Raja's attempt to portray her as a radical liberal is a lie, citing her appointment by President Bush to be Assistant Secretary of Veterans Affairs. President George W. Bush would not have and did not um, uh, nominate an extremist to be in his administration. He hired a committed, capable, competent public servant, which is exactly what I would be if I get sent to Harrisburg. Raja says Iovino's biggest lie about him is that he voted against Buy American provisions as a township commissioner. You never voted against no. Buy American provisions. No, I did not. I wasn't even at that meeting. One area of agreement, the communities to watch on Election Day. You've got to look at Moon, got to look at Bethel Park. Moon Township, Mount Lebanon, Bethel Park. Now, Bethel Park, Mount Lebanon, and Moon are the biggest communities in the 37th District where the votes are. But all 36 communities count, say the candidates, and especially getting their supporters to the polls wherever they live in the district. Now, I've seen no independent polling in the district, but both candidates think they are winning. Once again, the key is... Who votes on Tuesday? Reporting live, I'm John Delano.